Trading Places. You know how sometimes after a big lunch of sunflower seeds, you have interesting thoughts? Peep is having one right now. Hey, Newton. Do you ever wonder what it would be like if you were a chicken instead of a turtle? Um... No? Because that's what I'm wondering. What if we were all different? What if I was a butterfly and Chirp was a duck? And you were a squirrel, and Quack was a turtle. <laughs> Excuse me, what? If I was a what? Peep, that's crazy talk. I warned you not to eat so much. Oh, oh boy. Mm. But don't you think it would be fun to walk around with a shell on your back? Mm. No. Or climb trees, like a squirrel? No. Are you even curious about- Peep! Mm. Let me explain. I am a duck. I don't wonder. I'm not curious. I don't do anything but live a simple, carefree duck life. Burp. You know, it's an interesting thought, Peep. I enjoy being a turtle, but I often wonder how it would feel to climb a tree. Uh, me too. Or fly in the air. Or walk on a flower. Just like a real butterfly. Hmm. Oh, peep. If you were a butterfly, I'd be confused. Peep started to dream. He dreamed that he was standing on a flower looking down at Quack. Only Quack didn't look like Quack. Peep, I thought I told you I don't want to be a turtle. I can't help it, Quack. I'm having a dream. Look at your beautiful shell and your four feet. They're too big. I can't even lift them. Peep. Hey, there's Chirp. Let's go say hi. Let's not and say we did. Oh, all right, I'm coming. Am I even moving? Walking, but not getting anywhere. What is the point of this? Peep, come back here. Peep! Hey, watch where you're going, mister. What? You almost smooshed me, you big turtle. I'm not a turtle, I'm a duck. And these feet are all Peep's fault. Go tell them that I can't move and I'm smooshing ants. You're a duck? Then how come you look like a turtle? It's complicated. Look, please go tell Peep. He's the chicken who looks like a butterfly. You can't miss him. Anyway, tell him to come back here and wake up so I can go back to being a duck. KK? Are you okay? Of course I'm okay. I just need you to go get Peep and tell him to fly home immediately. Ah, look out! Mister, you saved my life. I owe you. Yeah, great, whatever. Go find Peep and tell him that this duck is tired of being a turtle. Got it. Turtle, no. Duck, yes. I am on it. <laughs> These wings are so big and flappy. Watch this, Chirp. <laughs> That's great! Now watch what I can do! I'm a duck, and ducks are best, better than all the rest of you guys! And hey, guess what? I love my hat! <laughs> <laughs> so what else is fun about being a duck? Waddling is fun! It feels sort of like rocking! And these big, flat feet make a lot of noise! Listen! Do you want to try swimming? Oh, interesting. Let's go. Hey, come back. There's a very confused turtle who needs your help. 
<laughs> Hello? Excuse me. It's Newton. I'm in the tree. Look at that. My dream turned you into a squirrel. I do realize that, yes. And I must say, as thrilling as it is to be in a tree, I'm a little nervous about coming down. You know your problem, Newton? You're built like a squirrel, but you're thinking like a turtle. Hmm. I see your point. But how does one get into the proper squirrel mindset? Hmm. I think you need to be more jumpy. Like this. Yes. Now picture a huge, yummy acorn on the branch below, and go! <gasps> I did it! Whee! <laughs> Quite an adventure. Mm. Thanks for the advice. No problem. Ducks love to give advice. <laughs> <laughs> Catch up. So, what do you think? The part of me that's a red bird isn't so sure about this. This is my dream, remember? And in my dream, you're 100% duck. Okay. Just don't wake up while I'm out there. This isn't scary at all. There's no way I can sink. And these feathers don't even feel wet. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> Do you know how hard it is for an ant to chase a butterfly? I'm not a butterfly, actually. I'm a chicken. Don't confuse me. I already got totally confused by a turtle who thinks he's a duck. Quack? Where is he? He's back there, moaning. He wants you to wake up and turn him back into a duck. Can you do that? Are you magic or something? Nope, just dreaming. Oh. Poor Quack. Chirp, I think I have to wake up now. Really? Are you sure? I like it out here. Hurry up, Chirp. It's happening. I'm starting to wake up. <laughs> Mm. Oh, no! Chirp! She's still in the pond! I have to go see! I'm right here, Peep. What's up? Whew. I guess it was just a dream. I was a butterfly, and Quack was a turtle, mm -hmm. and Newton was there, too, in a tree. Only he was a squirrel, and Chirp was a duck. Ah, <laughs> uh, Chirp is a duck. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I just... What's funny? I'd make a very good duck. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. Yeah, a duck who's afraid to get wet. <laughs> Headline, duck afraid to get wet. I would not be afraid. I'd be totally, totally not afraid. Did I have fun in your dream as a squirrel? Yes, yes you did. Once you got the hang of it. I'm so glad. <sighs> I'm so glad. I finally got to climb a tree. <laughs> <laughs>